Is that camera rolling? Yes, it is. What's going on, guys? My name is Zach. Be guests to call me hazardous. Welcome back to another video. This is something different than I usually see over here on my channel. Honestly, this is going to be a shitty video. My iPhone is set up on a speaker that's balanced against the wall. That's how we're going to roll this video. I'm using the front-facing camera on my iPhone. Like, come on. This is going to be like 480p or something. I got my setup over there, my bathroom over here, and I'm wearing the G Fuel Gorilla shirt. Let's go. So anyway, uh, T. Morton and Syndicate hashtag exposed. They, you know, they got their gambling website, CSGO Lotto. Um, I just want to go, you know, kind of talk about this. Rather than doing it in a gaming video and put it over, like, Call of Duty gameplay, why not come to you guys face-to-face? -face? I'm, like, backing up over my bed here. I'm about to fall the fuck over. And it's not, you know, I could honestly aim this camera just up just a tad bit so my head's more. There we go. You know, you got the, uh, what is it, the, the, the rule of threes for cinema, you create nine boxes on the left side, one, two, three, top third, middle third, bottom third, and middle, middle third, top, bottom, top, bottom, and middle. Anyway, it's so you can balance, you know, so I'm in the right, I'm going on a whole rant right here. Anyway, guys, T. Martin and Syndicate, they are now exposed for, you know, attracting people to bet on their websites that they own, that they didn't disclose I'm still not sure of the full story here, so I would like to get a little bit of a discussion going in the poll or in the comments section below. Get a little bit, get a little bit of a poll going. You know, what your guys' thoughts are on this, and if you guys can inform me, uh, you know, just everything that's going on, because I'm totally not familiar with it. Um, but yeah, from what I know right now is that they are making videos on, uh, you know, Counter Strike, Lotto, whatever. And, you know, it's a skin betting website. If you guys don't know what Counter-Strike is, it's a competitive shooter. And these guys are making videos saying, um, you know, of them winning tons of money on the website, tons of skins that they're able to sell. But the fact is that they own these websites, so they're just getting skins anyway. And now nine-year-old kids are like, oh, I want to win these skins too. And then they go on the website and waste all their money, and it all goes to T-Martin and Syndicate. That's a big issue, okay? Because when you don't disclose that you own a website and you're promoting that website... And you're like falsely advertising that you're winning all this money. That's a big deal, okay? As I just got off watching um, uh, White Boy Seventh Street's video on this, and you know he he was talking about there's all the FTC regulations, which is true. They're like this is a big deal. This is a big legal issue. I was Snapchatting my friend Brian too. His, uh, his channel name's Arrow. Actually, I'll link it down in the description too. This is a big fucking deal, because he was like, oh, they're legally fucked, and that's true, I really think they are, you, you, you can't do this type of stuff, and the fact, okay, you know, legalities, ex legalities aside, they're lying to their fans, they're straight up being like, oh, you can win all this money, when in reality, they're like giving themselves that money, essentially, on the betting website, because they fucking own it, and they've programmed it, maybe, I don't know, uh, that's something you can tell me in the comments, but they're lying to their fans, and that's what you call shady, all right? You don't do that, especially Syndicate at 11 million whatever subs and T. Martin at 3 million. You don't fucking lie to your subs. There's no reason to lie to your subs at that size, okay? I could upload a picture of my butt <laughs> to, like, Twitter, and it would get, like, 10,000 likes if I had 3 million subscribers on YouTube. You know, I could literally upload a one-second video of, like, the ceiling and just put ad revenue on that, and, like, a million people will watch it just because... I'm a person with that amount of subs, and there's no reason to lie to your fans, because when you could do that with your fans, there's no reason to have to be shady and try and get more money out of this stuff. You're already making tons of money being a legitimate human being, okay? So I don't get it. They're exposed. They're they're pretty much fucked. Um, say goodbye. Rip their channels. Rip their... Ob obviously, their CSGO websites. Those are done. Those are 100% done, but... um. Yeah, we'll see what happens to their channels. I think this is Syndicate's third strike. There was the uh, Microsoft Xbox One FCC regulation thing that he had an issue with. CSGO thing now. And he had one other thing I can't really place, uh, you know, put it on the top of my head here to kind of tell you guys. But, yeah, Syndicate's 100% fucked. T. Martin, sorry, bud. That was a bad decision. Don't make stupid decisions like this. That's all I could say. That's what my Spanish teacher junior year said. Uh, make good decisions. Okay, guys, have a fantastic day. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed this and want me to do, like, other videos like this of other YouTubers getting exposed or just talking like this to a camera like this, let me know down in the comments, okay? I, you know, I hope you guys enjoy. Hope you guys have a fantastic day. Thank you guys again. Leave a like if you guys enjoyed. Share this with your friends. I'll see you guys next time. Adios, amigos.